Pikachu wagging her tail. Shaka's wagging hers. You don't understand. She's up, well, now she's over here. Right now, Shaka is looking at Pikachu like, who is this nut? <laughs> did Pika actually try jumping up on the bed? I think she did. I mean, she, I mean, she, keeps, she keeps clawing at it like she wants to get up. When we're good and ready, we'll get back to it. Shock you, Laka. No, no. No, no, no. <laughs> you okay? Oh, she just knocked over the bottle. Yeah. 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 Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no. Peek is that way. Yeah, you used to be that small. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, wow. Your little Mimi. Her tail hasn't stopped wagging yet. <laughs> <laughs> to add to this fascination, Pikachu is like what? Twelve years old. Going on it. She's gonna be twelve come January. And I think you got poo pooed for uh, for your methods of how you feed her. But to be frank, I think Pika's extreme lethargy was due to lack of very variability and inspiration. She's acting just like a pop. <clears throat> as, as best as possible for her age, she's behaving more like a, the way I'd expect a pup to. How both Shock and Pika are acting are true. It's truly cute and all that. Yeah. 
But the the real centerpiece here is how Shaka on the scene seemed to revitalize Pikachu. Yeah. That's the real. That, see, see, that's really what I'm spotlighting. Shaka's cute and all that. Yeah, you know, I'm noticing the vitality in Pikachu. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Munchkin is being Munchkin. typical. Oh, no, you don't. He's not even paying us any, never mind. No. Like, all he needs to know is his space is respected. We're here if he wants to play with us or if he needs us. Most cats don't. And beyond that, He's letting me know he's good here. Well, Shaka is only like about six weeks old. And like I said, this is about how big Pikachu was when I first got it. Maybe a little smaller. And here comes the fourth member of the fur babies. Mulligan, aka the four legged orange garbage disposal. <laughs> Shaka's still here, it's just she decided she wants me holding her. It's hard to both video and hold her at the same time. You hand it to me. Director change. Yeah, and also next, and also next time we do a video, mm -hmm. lighting. Here I am on the other side of the cameraman. Chris Rice, other side of the radio. Yeah. That's from the parody. Ah. Now you don't want to be standing up the whole time. Oh, mercy. I don't need to hear that. Yeah. Just enough so that... Mom, Mom, Pikachu. Come on. Not out. We, we weren't trying to shut you out. Come on back in here. I like the dude's mannerisms. I don't know why I don't need to hear that. <sighs> Last is thinking misophonia. Some have it bad. Some have it worse than others. Certainly. Think it's about time for me to preheat the oven, put them cookies in. Sounds good to me. Right. Um, this is in the part one of today's adventures in puppy sitting. So we'll be back. <laughs>